Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can install the Cyanogen mod 10.2 Android version 4.3 on your HTC One. So this custom ROM works for international T-Mobile as well as the AT&T version of HTC One. So to install this custom ROM on your phone, your phone needs to be rooted and must have any custom recovery installed like the clockwork mode recovery now just navigate to the link below in the description box and that link will take you to the following page and from here you can just download the required files for your phone you can download the rom and the gapps file so just download the files and transfer it onto your memory so after the transfer is complete just press the volume down and the home button at the same time. And leave it when you see Edge Boot displayed on your screen. So just navigate to recovery using the volume buttons and enter the recovery mode using the power button. So now your phone will reboot into recovery mode. So to install this custom ROM on your phone, first we must perform a full wipe. So just find this wipe data factory reset option and delete all user data. Then find this wipe cache partition option, hit yes, wipe cache. Then go to advanced. Find the swipe Dalvik cache option, hit yes, wipe Dalvik cache. Now go back, hit install from SD card, choose zip from SD card, then navigate to wherever you have stored the custom ROM. Here I have it, Sanogen mod 10.2 on my phone, so just, so just hit it and hit yes install. So it may take a while to install this custom ROM on your phone. So the installation is complete. So now just hit choose G from SD card again. And now navigate to wherever you have stored the G apps file. So here I have it, the G apps for my phone. Hit yes install. So it will start installing the G apps file. So the installation is complete. Go back and hit reboot system now so for the first boot it may take a while my phone is up now so let me just skip the basic settings and now the installation is complete so let me just show you I'm running Android version 4.3 on my phone So that's all on how you can install this custom ROM on your phone. If you have any queries, just comment below or hit me on Facebook and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.